home. Was Vigo at home tonight? They hosted North Vermillion. Vikings opening drive from the Falcons 38. Vikes QB Dane Andrews throws the jump ball to the corner of the end zone. The 6'4 senior Colton Yates brings it in for the touchdown. Later in the Vikings opening series, this time from the Falcons 25, Andrews connects with junior Brandon Strode who fights his way and the goal line extends for the touchdown. Final play for the Vikings varsity. The quick snap, Andrews unleashes down the sideline to Matt Berkeley, who gets past the Falcons D for a touchdown. Now it's the Falcons turn on offense. First play from scrimmage goes to senior Christian Myers, who runs into the Vikings territory for the 30 plus yard play. Two plays later, junior QB Brennan Ellis connects with senior Corey Bukas for the red zone touchdown. Remember this Brennan Ellis kid has all the makings of a superstar. Nor familiar back on defense. Bukas was filling in this one. You can't read a QB any better than that. That's his third interception of the game. That'd be rolled a pick six for the Falcons. West Vigo opens next Friday at home against 1A state ranked North Central, while North Vermillion will have to wait an extra day until next Saturday for their opener at home against Evansville Bossy.